What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Philly Picker YouTube channel. My name's Joe. Today's video I'm going to go over 10 items that I sold over the weekend on eBay. Total sales were $468.70. If you are new to the channel, I'm a part-time reseller based in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where I basically resell items that I pick up at thrift stores, garage sales, estate sales, and I resell them on eBay. I know this is another what sold video that I'm putting out. Um, I usually put out a uh, haul video around this time of things that I picked up over the weekend at garage sales or the thrift store or state sales. But this weekend I was pretty much tied down to the house. Um, I had to finish up some continuing education classes um, that I had to do for uh, real estate. Um, I do hold a real estate license in, in uh, Pennsylvania. And uh, every two years, we have to do some continuing education classes. So on top of having a full-time job, on top of uh, selling part-time on eBay and doing part-time real estate, um, I try to get out two videos a week of things that I sold and things that I've picked up. Um, but this week, it looks like it's just going to be two what sold videos. I hope everybody understands um, that. I also put a shameless plug out there. If anybody is in the market for real estate in Pennsylvania, make sure to reach out to me. I'll help you out any way that I can. So let's get into what everybody's here for. Let's find out what's sold this weekend on eBay. First item, I'll put a picture up here on the screen. It's a Disney Seen It um, DVD game. I picked this up for $3.50 at the Goodwill, and I ended up selling it for $40 plus shipping. I received a message on Friday from the buyer asking me to ship this out right away, um, which I did. Um, he said it was a gift, but he also put in the message uh, not to include an invoice and uh, uh, no eBay stickers, things like that. So I'm assuming it's a drop shipper, but it doesn't matter to me. I paid $3.50 for this item. And I sold it for $40 plus shipping. I'm happy with that. Next item I picked up is from Walmart. It's a Cobra radar detector. I picked up three of these. Um, I think this is the last one I have. I picked it up for $15 each. Um, and they ended up selling for $52.98 plus shipping. This item is going to be real easy to ship. I'm uh, just going to put some bubble wrap on it. Uh, throw it in a padded flat rate. Uh, envelope and uh, send it out. It's heading over to Puerto Rico, so it's going to cost me seven dollars and fifty-two cents to send it out. Next up is this Swarovski. I think I'm saying it right. Um, crystal paperweight. It's a very small paperweight. Um, I picked this up at an auction at a uh, jewelry store. Most of you are familiar with that. I'll put the link up uh, up top if you want to check out that video. It was a 100-year-old uh, uh, jewelry store that was going out of business, and they had an auction there to auction off uh, all their inventory. So I ended up picking this up th there. I have $10.50 into this one when I did an average buy cost, and it ended up selling for $19.98 plus shipping. This is another easy item to ship out. Just going to bubble wrap it, throw it in one of the small eBay boxes, and it should ship out at a... Um, five ounce rate next item i have up is a set of two 10 pound um weights i'd already um pre-packaged these it's just easier to store them that way i bubble wrap them tape them together and throw them in a flat rate envelope um so there's two 10 pound weights in there i picked these up at walmart for seven dollars and 77 cents each so i have somewhere around 16 dollars into um this package and it ended up selling for $59.98 with free shipping. It fits in a flat rate envelope, so it's going to ship out at $7.52. So after all said and done, after fees, I'll probably make somewhere around $27, $28 on this item. They're pretty fast sellers. I, I sold three sets of these this weekend. These are just regular uh, weights that they sell on the uh, sporting goods section of Walmart. So if you do come across them at uh, your Walmart, pick them up. Next up is this Vacation Stamps puzzle. It's a 2,000 piece puzzle. Um, I picked this up at Target. It was in the clearance section. Um, they were marked down to $6. And I sold two of these this weekend. I ended up selling for $37.98 with free shipping. 
These sold pretty quick too. I only picked them up last week. I picked up three of them and all three have sold within a week. Next up is a clothing item. Um, I picked this up at the Salvation Army for $2. It's a vintage um, Pittsburgh Steelers crew neck sweatshirt. I had this item list, listed in my store for a while. Um, I had it up for I think $22 and I sent out um, offers to some watchers over the weekend and I sent out an offer for $15 and somebody jumped right on it. So this was $15 plus shipping and it was a $2 buy cost. And last up is this coach purse. I picked this coach purse up at the Salvation Army for $5. Um, I just listed it on Sunday and it sold right away and sold within a few hours of listing it and I put it up for $39.98 with free shipping and that's what it sold for. So that was everything that sold for me over the weekend. It was a total of $468.70 in sales. Um, I'm pretty much happy with that. I'm not complaining. Thank you again for stopping back and checking out a video. I appreciate it. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye, everybody.